Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to add a new person to Google Chrome. Some people might call it an, a new profile or a new user. Call it whatever you want. What you need to do is just click on the icon in the top right corner. And this is great because you can separate your work profile, for example, from your personal profile. Or if you have multiple people using their computers who have their own collection of bookmarks, they can have their own personalized Google Chrome. All right, up here in the right corner, find this little avatar. Even if you don't have a profile set up, you can still click on it. You'll still find add. So you want to type in the username and then pick a avatar. Go with a bicycle. Ooh, cheese. Cheese. So what I'm going to show you now is when you hit add, you're going to get two desktop shortcuts. For example, here's my Google Chrome shortcut. When I click add, I'm going to have two new shortcuts, one for each user or profile. So there's Major Geeks Chrome, and there is Tim Chrome. And you can just, when you're ready to go, just double click whichever one you want, size it where you want. Now it will bring in a lot of the extensions from the other profile frequently. So what you want to do is click there. And if you don't want to use it, just click on it and click remove. And do that as many times as possible. The other option, of course, is to enable the extension. There you go. All right, let's close this out. Let's go back to our main browser. Now, you change your mind. You want to get rid of the user. It's faster and easier to get rid of the user than it actually is to add them. So what you want to do now is come over here. And there's a couple things you can do. So let's look at this. So let's click on the gear. That's how we're going to remove them. Without clicking, line your mouse over the profile. Look for the three dots to appear right here. Click on that and click on remove this person. If you click anywhere else, it'll just open the browser. Well, let's do that again. Gear, mouse over, click over these three dots, remove. Click remove this person. What's nice about this is let's say you made a mistake and you want to change the name or something, you can quickly remove them and just do add person and you go right back to where we were a minute ago. And that's pretty much it. As always, this guide will be linked to in the tutorial. The video will be embedded when I'm done somewhere around here. So you could actually follow the screenshots in the video at the same time if you like. Look up at the top here for a link to get to that page. And uh, yeah, that should about do it. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.